The Oregon Symphony is marking its 125th season this year with plans to bring back in person performances in the fall. Until then, though, they've launched a digital destination for music that anyone can enjoy. Stephen Redland tells us about Studio 125. The Oregon Symphony is celebrating a few milestones. Some parallels to Baroque suites. The retirement of musical director Carlos Calmar and its 125th anniversary. Welcome to the Oregon Symphony's Studio 125. They're also premiering Studio 125. The symphony is going even more virtual. As you scroll down the Studio 125 page, you'll come across lots of digital content to view. Categories like classical session. Symphony Storytime. My name is Charlie Renault. I play the bass trombone, and this is what it sounds like. And more to explore. It's got all kinds of programs for the world to enjoy for free until we can be back on stage again. Scott Showalter is the Oregon Symphony's president and CEO. For the 40 staff and 80 full-time artists, the past year has been tough. Last year was different. Tell me what you guys went through. Our business is ultimately based on in-person experiences. But even in the pandemic, the music plays on. Jesse Montgomery to Mendelssohn to Mozart. I mean, there's, there's definitely a little bit of everything. Yeah. Anna Klein, Caroline Shaw, there's just so much good stuff. The symphony's principal bassist, Brazon Jones, has been busy creating these online performances. With unrest in our city, healing music is even more important. I think that's a very graceful process that music has a huge part in. And it really brings people together to kind of like bond over these uh, once contentious issues and maybe turn them into something more productive. The symphony played to hundreds of thousands in Portland in the past seasons. Today, Studio 125 is bringing their performances to people around the whole world. And our goal ultimately is to bring the joy and power of music to more people in new ways. These virtual performances on Studio 125 have built hope for the symphony's new season. The upcoming 125th celebratory year is scheduled for in-person concerts this coming October. In Portland, I'm Stephen Redland, KGW News. The music returns in October, he says, live yeah. music. Anyway. Happy 125 to the symphony.